DEQ proposals to change city codes could affect the way Austin food trailers operate, like Hey Cupcake and Torchy's Tacos, some favorites around here. Some say the proposals will endanger those businesses. There are dozens and dozens of these food trailers who are watching city council very closely to see if they're going to enforce those codes. Our KXAN's Matt Fleener also watching council members to see how they are going to vote on this issue. Hi, Matt. Well, hi there, Sally. We're here at FN Good Burger, right on, right on near the UT campus of 27th and Guadalupe. Looks like a normal kitchen, doesn't it? You've got the grill down here. They make some pretty good burgers here. Uh, but this is not a normal kitchen. This is actually a, a food trailer like the ones the city is looking to regulate. Mobile food trailer owners are really organizing at the last minute to try and prevent some of these changes that are going into effect, uh, possibly going into effect. The owners of Snappy Snacks and Amy's Ice Cream recommended changes to this current city code on trailer food vendors. But trailer eateries say the changes will limit and possibly put them out of business. Changes to the city code will require tougher parking requirements, uh, shorter hours, and tougher requirements for where bathrooms are placed. Now, the Austin Fire Department would also be involved in the inspection process of these trailers. Those that own mobile food eateries here in Austin say the changes are pretty tough. There's nothing, there's nothing about me running my business that makes it right for me to get somebody sick. Um, we, we're all about public safety. We're all about public health. Like I said, there's lots of last-minute organizing right now to try and prevent some of these changes from happening. There's actually a special council subcommittee that's meeting today at 3 o'clock. We'll hear more about the changes and what these trailer food vendors are pushing to do to try and stop these changes. That's at 3 o'clock today. We'll bring you more on KXAN Austin News at 5 o'clock. For now, we're live in, near the UT campus. Matt Fleener, KXAN Austin News.